What is up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Street Legal Racing Redline. And what we're doing today is building up a, uh, I believe it would be like a 2011 uh, Subaru Impreza WRX STI. Uh, could it might be a 2011 or you know around there? It's that same body style. I already put the motor in, tuned it, put the suspension on, tuned it. So all we have to do is just throw on our bumpers, go paint the vehicle, then we can go take it out and uh, go do some rally racing with it because this is a uh, rally build that we're doing today with it. If I did not say that at the beginning, which I don't think I did. I just pretty much throw everything on here. Uh, we do have the uh, upgraded STI bumpers, like the number twos that it shows for the game, um, which I believe are like the uh, racing setup ones or whatever looks pretty badass with them all on it actually and i hadn't done that yet seen it what it looks like the uh our you know motor doesn't stick through the uh you know intercooler or anything there so it looks all nice and beautiful it doesn't look fucked up from the bottom here the only place where the uh we have to back out of here before i can open up the hood uh the only thing only way it doesn't look quite perfect is when you look into it because it is a b12 uh the same motor we had in the last build of the uh, audi r8 lms so it's a v12 in here as you can see there it does clip a little bit through with the uh firewall there but you can't see it inside the vehicle so it uh kind of works out perfectly so let's go ahead and go paint this up real quick i think uh we might do like a red or something like that on it Maybe that nice blue. Let's see what this red looks like. Oh yeah, that looks good. Definitely go with this red. Now we probably could paint the roll cage as well if we pulled out one of the windows or just opened up a door. We could probably get in there and paint it, uh, but we're not going to worry about that. As you can see, the camera decided to glitch a little bit through the wall over here, but that's okay. We can still paint up everything. And give it this little red look here and it looks badass with this red on it honestly i would say it looks pretty badass so we can go ahead and back on out of here now um we are going to remove the front window because it probably has glare on it uh like all the other windows and i kind of want to do a little bit of first person driving with this thing so we'll go with no front window and uh i'm gonna go save the game and then take it out to the rally track uh, that we did before the UK rally. We're going to do all the stages of that uh, for this video. Most likely do all the stages of it. So see you guys in just a second. Alright. Guys, so we're out here at the rally, rally UK rally stage 1. Uh, for whatever reason, like the first time I came out here, it wasn't letting me drive my vehicle for some really odd reason. Uh, but... I do need to go here because this motor is a bit loud as I realized in the uh, other video so we will turn it down just a bit to make sure you guys can hear me just fine all right so let's uh head out here Ooh, let's not hit the nitrous because uh, that's how, how you blow your motor <clears throat> be nice and easy on the throttle here because it is a bit crazy there we go. All right. we'll have to drift around some of these corners because with the uh, lift I put on here it does not quite want to handle properly no no not the fucking w yeah damn it that's what I get for taking the thumbnail hear that blow off though from them buckering things let's fix the vehicle up real quick we're starting off this rally uh nice and strong here what the hell man all right guys so the game crashed uh when i fixed my vehicle up so i figured we would just take it out here to the uh the city out here to Valo during the daytime so I don't know if there's going to be any racers around and don't see any on the map but uh yeah we might as well just tear up the city and end the video 
you know, like whenever we fucking crash the whole thing out. A little bit of a lag going on, but that's the, uh, just going to be due to our speed, like, and I won't do it all the time. Like right now it's running nice and smooth, but sometimes it'll lag a little bit just do the dynamic vrc you know changing up its you know settings and everything it's pretty cool but we'll hit the highway here and uh see what we can do go to first person here so the motor might be a little loud but yeah first person Ooh, man look at that steer death bottle man we're too too uh Ooh, 180 180 dude jesus oh there's some drivers on the uh mini map there Golly, man. i'm just trying to control it like you see how the steering wheel kind of flips out a little bit there that's not me that's just it deciding it wants to flip out oh god oh god oh god oh there was a little bit of lag there <laughs> Oh, that's the steering. Freaking out. Freaking out, man. Oh my god, 200. God, 220. 232. Fucking shit. <laughs> Breaks out. <laughs> Fuck. Oh no. Oh my god. We lost the motor. Oh my god. It's dead. Oh my god. Well, this is a short video. Oh. <laughs> Hold on, let me reset it here so it, uh, oh my god, dude, <laughs> look at this shit, oh my god, oh man, that was a bad wreck, I wish we weren't on the inside view for that one, oh my god, dude, it's fucked up, man, oh man. All right, guys. Uh, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and end the video there after crashed out trying to rally it. Oh, man. And now it's just destroyed. We literally lost everything for the vehicle. The only thing we have is our nitrous tanks, our fucking spoiler, our uh, exhaust, our trunk, some of our uh, suspension parts, one window... Somehow the intercooler's still there, just hanging. Wow. Just death for the car. Alright guys, hope y'all enjoyed it. And I'll see y'all in the next one. XO Froggy out.